Brussels, the 11th of November 2017. On the 6th of November, the Saudi-led military coalition closed air, sea, and land entry points to Yemen. This decision has caused major disruptions in the urgent delivery of life-saving activities and a sharp rise in the price of basic commodities, as confirmed by EU partners on the ground. The country is suffering the world's worst humanitarian crisis, with more than two-thirds of its population in need of humanitarian assistance. The EU shares the concerns expressed by the UN Emergency Relief Coordinator Mark Lowcock and calls for full and unrestrained access to be restored immediately, to avoid Yemen to suffer the largest famine in decades. This would risk further undermining the prospects of reaching a sustainable political settlement to the ongoing conflict. On this basis, the EU has been in contact with the Saudi authorities. Initial measures to resume operations in Aden Port and to open Al Wadiya border crossing are a step in the right direction. The EU urges the coalition to ensure the immediate resumption of the UN's flights and activities in the ports of Hodeida and Salif and the opening of land borders for humanitarian relief and basic commercial commodities. The delivery of life-saving supplies is critical for the Yemeni population and must be facilitated by all parties to the conflict.